Hey everybody, we are here at the farm today. Um, just uh, doing some cleaning up, some gardening, and uh, it's uh, the 1st of January, so happy 2021. Sorry I haven't been uh, doing very many videos, but the duck hunting, it's been okay. It's just that whenever I have the camera, there are no ducks. And whenever I don't have the camera, they're just, I mean, it's just the same story, right? Ducks must be, uh, just like fish, they must be camera shy. So uh, before we go anywhere, let's uh, start off this welcome with a greeting call right there. <laughs> welcome to the show. New Year's Day and uh, it's cold and figured might as well come roast some uh, canvas back out here. Now the fire is actually getting really hot. I can feel it. So we're almost ready just to do our, once this stuff kind of burns down, see I still got my twigs here. Get some of these bigger pieces going and then um, we'll get my seasoned uh, canvas back up there. Let's take a look at something kind of cool. Well. This is my very first duck hunting seat right here, old milk crate. As uh, some of you guys saw the video of me hunting uh, geese, that was actually the first time, hey Penny, that we'd uh, gone for waterfowl. So um, yeah, set up out here, just about 40 yards that way, and uh, those geese came over. It's goose season again. I actually have the gun loaded up, don't get me wrong. As we sit here, figure might as well I just joined uh, Ducks Unlimited this year, everybody. So I, it's actually a really good organization. You know, there's some politics involved, and not everyone's, you know, agreeing on that. There's Delta Waterfowl and a couple different organizations. All I just gotta say is, uh, whatever it is, if you like the sport, you know, if you if you really like duck hunting, um, join join one of these uh, these clubs. You know, they do a lot for waterfowl. Even if you don't agree with what you know one does, you can choose a different one. You know, um, I'm in. Uh, I've got. Backcountry hunters and anglers, um, the elk foundation. I don't even hunt elk yet, but I want to hunt in the future. But this month they sent out a uh, really cool magazine. Check that out right there. Bull Sprig, everybody. That is a lot of people's favorite duck. That sucker is made for speed. That long neck, those racing stripes on the side, chocolate head. That's a badass duck. Um, yeah, that's, you know, uh, let me know. Do you hunt? Do you hunt pintails where you where you come from? Do you guys get these guys? Some places don't. I don't think that the eastern uh, flyway has very many uh, pintails, um, but mostly the central, uh, like Mississippi flyway does. Uh, out here in the west, the west coast, dude, we get a ton of these guys, and the limit is one. And seeing those big crosses in the sky, you know, as that drake comes over, uh, those giant groups of pintails just swirling, circling forever and ever and ever. Um, yeah, I, I like I like hunting them too. They taste off. Here in California, a lot of people don't think that they come down. They shoot them as they pass. Mm -mm. Pintail come down. Um, all the ducks come down. Here you go, guys. First pintail of the year. My God, how freaking exciting. How freaking exciting. All right, buddy. Good, Louie. Drop it, drop it, drop it. Hey, hey. Thank you, Louie. Thank you, my buddy. Oh my gosh, I picked the one with the uh, Longest sprig on him, everyone. So, pardon me for uh, 
trophy hunting. But as soon as I saw that giant sprig, I had to have him. Hope he tastes good. Beautiful, beautiful head. Beautiful. Yeah, pintails, good. But the other duck, we're not eating pintail today. We're eating canvas back. We're eating canvas back. Um, had a great canvas back hunt, guys. I uh, couldn't film much of it. Uh, didn't bring my camera out for the first part because it was too raining. It was raining. And uh, so we set up in there and uh, got my two. It was a double. Here's a clip. Keep calling them, keep calling them. Keep calling them, keep calling them. They'll, they'll come in if they, if they want. You don't see the first shot, but I doubled up right there. That's my limit, my camera's back limit. And these two came right on through the uh, the decoys, right in my face actually, banked to the right as, as they saw me come up and they turned and slipped at about, it's, I mean, it looks far, but it's not far. That's like probably about 30, 35 yards only. Um, dumped them both, you know, uh, as you know, I shoot a, uh, an, uh, what is it, skeet one choke. So it's pretty open, very open. And um, on one of those guys, uh, I gave the other one to my friend, but on one of them I plucked it and man, there were something like 10 uh, hits for my number two pellets on the body. So we're talking, you know, direct hit, um, it's close. Uh, I got to get that spread as open as possible and uh, did a good job. They taste great, guys. Uh, people say that, oh, divers, blah, blah, you know, whatever. Uh, honestly, divers taste really good. The skin is not the same and you can't eat them like steak the way that you do uh, mallards and other puddle ducks. But um, as far as eating goes, yeah, they're, they're really bomb. As long as they're in the uh, poachard family, they're really good. I still have to try the golden eye type ones, golden eye and buffalo heads. I haven't eaten them yet. I'll try them. Didn't you? What is it? What'd you find? This is just salt, pepper, a little bit of coffee grounds. Let's see how that goes. Test the heat first. <laughs> yeah, that's super nice. That is hot. And this one. Guys, the uh, Peking Five Chinese Five Spice stuff. We don't incorporate too much Chinese Five Spice. While that cooks up, let's get in on some more duck hunting action. You see, the thing is, actually, on this day, we had a lot of fog, and honestly, it was going really slow until that fog burned off a little bit. But when it did, we actually were in a prime spot to hunt diver ducks. This is where I got the canvas backs from. That clip was uh, my first wood duck of the year and a gorgeous one at that. If you'll remember that rolling the R sound inside the mallard call is how you make the grunt of the dive ducks. Oh, there's a pintail. Pintail. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. You can't. Watch it, Anthony, if it... Oh. Louis, get it! Get it, Louis, get it! Get it, get it, boy, get it! Yeah! Yeah, good boy! boy. That's a hen pintail. Yeah. Woo -hoo. Hey, good game on! It's, who it's, who it's shot it? It's a modified choke, man. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, the Anthony, 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 grab it. Yeah. Anthony, get it. Uh, what is it? Pen pintail. There's your limit, your pintail limit. Still alive? Some mine. Wow, hen pintail, huh? Interesting. No. This is my second uh, hen pintail. 
I actually haven't got a um, got a drink yet. There you go. Worked. All right. Well, there you go. I guess you guys should have been over here in the first place, huh? Yep. <laughs> nice shot, dude. Bunch of diapers there. Like canvas backs. Oh, what do these canvas backs do? Oh, yeah, call your mallard. He's coming in. I still see him, this one. Single. Let him work. It's okay. He sees him. See them again? Okay, hold on. Everybody hide. Everybody hide. Where do the spoons go? What? Do they land?
I hope you enjoyed those clips from this year's hunts. Um, we had a great time, and uh, actually, I'm very sad that uh, hunting season, as of this recording, is over. So let's enjoy some of the uh, rewards of our harvest here. So this cook, this duck has been cooked. Uh, I like the way I like it. Medium rare, rare. Uh, not too gamey, but at the same time, you know, I don't, I don't like it tough either. So let's have at it, guys. It looks good. That, right there, that is what it's all for right there. Alrighty guys, well that's it right there. Got me a nice bowl of rice and uh, that's actually dove soup. That was, uh, we got that right before the end of the season. Along with my canvas back here, just take a bite. For some soup. Oh man. Oh, that's good. A bit of canvas back. Mm. Mm. I did not strip that. And eat. Wild game. Lovely to be. Oh. Just don't bite down too hard. I'll be seeing a dentist soon. Soup's good. Maybe needs a little bit more chili, but otherwise, mm, that medium rare duck. Come oh, on. You guys don't like divers. Don't shoot them. All you, buddy. Thanks for joining me. Been a whole day out here on the farm, couldn't have done it without you. Take care guys. All right, good people. Well, thank you for watching with me. I'll be posting up more things here shortly. Um, I have finally a little bit more time to edit and so we'll get more content out. 2021 is gonna be a beast. Thank you guys.